Thank you. Thank you so much. Okay. I think they're going to have the press come in, and I will just make a short statement. Well, first of all, let me say how pleased I am to be meeting with uh, representatives of the uh, Kenyan Elections Commissions and Civil Society at such a, an important uh, time in uh, the history of this great country. Uh, I've had the opportunity already today uh, in my meetings uh, with the President and the Prime Minister, with the Chief Justice and the Speaker, uh, to discuss the importance of a credible, transparent, free and fair election process. Uh, the Kenyan people have uh, demonstrated uh, a great commitment uh, to uh, their own democracy, uh, most recently with the successful referendum on the new constitution. Um, but we know that uh, there are challenges, and this is the uh, opportunity to uh, meet those uh, going forward. Uh, not only is this important for the people of Kenya, but uh, the eyes of the world will be on this election. Uh, and I have absolute uh, uh, confidence that uh, Kenya has a chance to be a model uh, for other nations, uh, not just here in Africa, but around the world. Um, on the other hand, the um, unrest that can result from a disputed election uh, has a terrible cost. Uh, both in lives lost and in economic impact. Uh, the instability that followed the last election cost the Kenyan economy, by most estimates, more than $1 billion. So it's essential for government and civil society to work together. And of course, uh, the Elections Commission has a special responsibility uh, to ensure that the votes and aspirations of the people are uh, reflected accurately and fairly. And so I'm here today to uh, listen and learn what the United States can do to support these very important efforts. Uh, we are committed uh, to our partnership. We are proud to be uh, a partner and a friend of Kenya, and we want to continue uh, doing all we can to help this country continue its uh, path forward. Our emphasis has always been on uh, supporting uh, the lives of individuals and the democratic aspirations of people. Uh, so that is uh, the value of what we try to offer. Uh, so what we're interested in is how to be the best partner uh, and friend. Uh, and that's what I'm doing here in Kenya. We had a, a series of very comprehensive and constructive meetings today on a full range of issues. Uh, that uh, are important bilaterally between us, uh, but also regionally and globally. Um, of course, what happens in the elections is up to the people of Kenya. They're the ones who will make the decisions. Uh, but we, as a partner and friend, um, are certainly uh, hoping that this election, which is a complex election, there are many different uh, ballot uh, positions that will all be voted on the same time um, goes so smoothly that everyone is so proud the next uh, day because of what has been achieved and that people who are unsuccessful, remember I've been in politics, I have won elections and I have lost elections. And when you lose an election and when your supporters see you lose an election, it's important that they have to see that the process was fair. Uh, and that's what we hope for here uh, for our friends in Kenya.